let's come back after your um, <coughs> hydrogen bonding concept and now let's start go with the next chemical property of your sulfuric acid now basically sulfuric acid is going to show a wide range of reactions what on what basis is it showing first important thing sulfuric acid we also call it as king of chemicals isn't it now because why is it used in different process because of its low volatility it will not volatility it will not vapor vaporize when it so in the bottle is kept open so volatility is less it will but volatility is less compared to other chemicals next important thing it has higher acidity value so because of this higher acidity it is called as an acid than release of h plus and it's also good it's, it acts as a good oxidizing agent i'll show you those reactions also and uh, and it also forms bonds with water hydrogen bonding which i've already shown forms bonds with water hence boiling point is high isn't it so it forms bonds with water hence it has high bp okay now i've already done a question on this now i'll be doing a question on this acidity concept now see now what is the question why is ka2 very much lesser than ka1 for h2so4 they said what is ka and ka1 basically ka1 or ka2 what are they called this is called acid dissociation constant acid dissociation constant now this also is acid dissociation constant but here this is first acid dissociation constant and this is the second acid dissociation constant now what is the use of this this will basically determine the strength of the particular acid and we already studied higher the ka value or lower the pka value or lower the pka value lower the ka value and higher the uh, pka value both are inversely related isn't it so that then it would decide its stronger strength uh, that, that will decide the strength of the acid now let's come back and see now they said <coughs> first important sulfuric acid in water now when i take sulfuric acid in water then <coughs> this is the aqua solution okay now i'm taking water which is a liquid state this is going to dissociate which is an equilibrium state and h2 plus h now this is basically h and oh isn't it so you are h2 and h combines to form h3 o plus h H3O plus and H3O plus hydronium ion aqua state and what else do you have HSO4 minus 2 HSO4 minus done this is also aqua state now what are we going to do you are going to take this HSO4 minus that is a bisulfate ion which is aqua state it's again you are combining with water okay now <laughs> this is a liquid you are going to what do you get now you are going to further again get H3O plus H3O plus plus SO4 minus 2. Now, this is also aqua state. This is your aqua state. Now, for dissociating or release of H plus here, the first base dissociate, base, uh, sorry, first acid dissociation constant is denoted by Ka1. The value found was to be greater than 10. Done. The second one, when it was observed, Ka2, it was great, it is almost, you know, equal to 2 into 10 raised power of minus 2, 2.3 rather, 2.3 into 10 into minus 2. So, what are you observing? The Ka2 value is very much less than Ka1. This is what is the reason. So, Ka1 is almost 10 and this is 2 into 10 raised power of minus 2.3 into 10 of minus 2. Why is it less? Now, what is the reason? When I have dissociated this, I have got this value. When I have dissociated this, I have got this value. When do I get this value? When you are trying to remove a H plus or the hydronium ion from a molecule from this. Now, in case 1, what happened? In case 1, the release of H plus was easy for me. I can easily remove it from a neutral molecule, isn't it? This is neutral molecule. In case 1, H plus or H3O plus was released was removed from neutral sulfuric acid molecule this was the thing now in the second one what happened here when i have to remove one more from here what did we take the second one this is the second case so let me i'm if i'm confusing i'll put it in a box in the second case i was i'm i was uh, i'm supposed to take out protons from which one from a negative ion it's very uh, difficult isn't it it's easy to remove from a neutral molecule but removing a proton from a negative ion becomes difficult so in case two case two h plus 
removing H plus removing H plus or H3O plus from negative ion that is HSO4 minus negative ion is difficult hence the K value is decreased so that uh, thing that is what you have to remember it's easy I took out the K values become more the K value has reduced because I have to take out pull that proton from that negative ion so this is the reason